Well, a few high school seniors are doing something a little different over their summer break, learning the latest in cancer research. WND's Megan O'Dell, live at Millican University in Decatur tonight, where a summer program is giving high schoolers a head start in the chemistry fields, specifically. Megan. These young ladies have dedicated much more than just their summer break, working day in and day out on the latest in cancer research and breaking down barriers into different career fields. For Perry Grimes and Precious Dixon, the chemistry lab at Milliken University has been their summer vacation spot for eight weeks, working eight to five every day alongside Professor Ramelsberg and Barnes on the latest in cancer research. The goal really is to get them engaged in a research project where they can make progress, and, and they have, which is exciting. I mean, we're at the second to last stage, and we're getting ready to do cell testing. Actually, they're now to the stage of where they're combining the gold nanoparticles with the liposomes that will kill the, the cancer. Testing cancer cells and challenging themselves, both high school seniors, Perry and Precious, simulate the role of lab researcher. Basically, they leave us on our own, so then we can just um, comprehend everything and just do it ourselves. And if we mess up, we can know the mistakes and do things like that, so we can just do it ourselves. Either learning a new tool or working on breakthrough cancer research, students are gaining confidence every time they put on a coat. Last week, we started doing something different so that was interesting we started like putting liposomes with um like our gold samples that we made so like that was something new the program's name says it all project c planting an idea and opportunity to give these students much more than just an experience spread the message to other students that you know sometimes you could do the impossible or what seemed like impossible first right to be proud of yourself to know that you done something to help others out and planting the seed and sparking the minds of tomorrow both students do plan on going into the medical field once they graduate from college live indicator i'm megan odell w a and d news back to you i think that is so great i that don't is. remember anything like that when i was in high school no. and i just think it's so interesting that they're getting people interested in fields that they might not know about and you the know future. the parents have